Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Greg Michalowski from ForexLive.com. This is a uh, Forex uh, quick look. I'm going to take a look at the dollar versus uh, Swiss franc. Today's date is October 16, 2024. Let's get started. Fundamentally, in Switzerland, we saw CPI move uh, lower than expected a few weeks ago and also saw PPI move lower than expected uh, just a few days ago. Uh, and that has uh, helped to uh, push the uh, dollar Swiss uh, to the upside uh, through here. Uh, now it's been an up and down move, but Technically, what we saw in trading here today was a move above, back above the 38.2% retracement. That's of the move down uh, going back to July, early July high right here. This is a, the July 3rd high uh, to the low price that we saw in the, the month of September. The 38.2 comes in at 0 0.86318. And at, off at this four-hour chart, you can see how the price earlier this week did uh, try to move above it here, 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 here. Uh, each of the time the market moved above that level, we rotated down, rotated down, rotated down. But we did hold support right here against the low of this uh, swing area. This swing area is defined by different uh, swing lows and swing highs going back in time through this period right through here. This is um, in August, early first half of August, uh, before the market then uh, moved to the downside. We returned back to that area in trading a few weeks ago and in trading last week, we also moved to, to this area and found willing sellers against the level. So the break above it and the support against it uh, has given the buyers the go ahead to push to the upside and that's what we're seeing here in trading here today so uh, be aware of this level right down through here also the 38.2 percent retracement Th these levels will be uh, support going forward uh, as long as the price can remain above this level the buyers can uh, remain to the upside we could see further momentum in that direction on uh, the next uh, key target on the top side uh, if i were to uh, put a uh, um, you know, the biggest level uh, as a target, that would be right here. Uh, that's where the 100-day moving average and the 50% retracement of the same move from the July high to the September low comes in at 0 0.87116. So with the price currently trading at 0 0.8646, there's about 50, 60 or so pips left of uh, momentum uh, buying if the buyers can, if buyers can stay above the 38.2, if it could stay above this level right here, uh, and uh, we would uh, and the uh, momentum continues in the upward direction as a result, uh, and we'll see what happens there. That's going to be a nice juicy level for technical later traders to lean against uh, because of the dual nature of those technical tools and the importance of those technical tools. So be aware of that, uh, but certainly within the sights of buyers in this currency pair. So that's my technical look at the dollar versus Swiss franc. My name is Greg Michalowski. Good fortune with your trading. Bye-bye now.